a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. Wait, wait a second. This happened on Earth, right now. Oh, right. Well, very recently, in the galaxy we are in, there were two friends named Harry and Louie frolicking in the daisy fields when their friend, Zane, contacted them wait, while in peril. Wait, wait, wait. It's Zane. Hello? Help me, Harry and Louie. You're my only hope. It's very scary. There's a pillow talking to me. Help me. Where are you, mate? I'm in Bradford, England. Help, come, quick. Oh, no, we're in New York. You're all the way in Bradford. How are we going to get there in time? What are we going to do? Zane's our token Bradford bad boy. Don't worry, Cupcake. Let's call our travel agent. Nine. Who are you and what do you want with me? I am the talking pillow. My name is Liam. It is my duty to keep you here up all night until you take me home and we can make midnight memories until 4 a.m. where we will have made it in the a.m. Help! Oh no! Help! Hey guys, welcome to Niles' modest travel agency where we go in one direction. How can I help? Zane's in trouble and we need to get to Bradford, England ASAP. We, don't, we can't find any flight because we think they're all booked. Can you help us? Ah, oh, I've got the best idea. This is the newest super fast underwater train which can take you from US to UK in less than an hour. It's called the 9.75 Express. It goes faster than I can eat a meal at Nando's. Fast, right? <laughs> well, who created it? How does it work? How much does it cost? Can you book us a seat? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so the train carries about six people at a time, and it works by combining magnetic levitation with a vacuum tube tunnel about five feet in diameter underwater. The pressure is tested so it doesn't harm your body and is the right and is at the right tolerable amount, but the and the air between the tube and the train is permanently removed to allow for the train to travel rapidly. There are airlock, airlocks at each station to allow for air to be vacuumed out. Wow, who created it? Well, I googled it, and the schematics of the airlock were designed and developed by Daryl Oster of ET3. Look! According to scientist Colgan, he explained that to make the train safer while removing the air, the engineers would have to establish sections of airlock. One section is 500 miles long, and when the train approaches the next section, it is stopped and air is removed from it. Wow! This allows for any accidents or errors to, to occur to be taken care of, and make sure that the passengers reach their destination safely. Yup, so I can book your tickets for tonight. Great, thanks, Niall. Oh, how much longer till we get there? Hello, passengers. This is your captain speaking. We are 20 minutes into our ride and about halfway to our destination. Please stay seated, as it is not safe to stand up on this pressurized tube. As promised, you will reach your destination within an hour of your starting time. Zane, where are you? I'm in my room. Hello? Have you come to try to save your friend? Don't worry, you can join him too. Not today! We're here! I'll untie you. Thanks, babe, but how did you guys get here so fast? We took this super fast underwater train called the 9.75 Express. It combines magnetic levitation techniques with vacuum tubes using airlocks to reduce friction and increase speed. It can be used to travel to faraway lands, which can usually only be accessed by air travel. It's really, really useful for people to get to places for work, visit, or for traveling, or emergencies, like this one. They've been benefited by this, like we have, because they can respond to situations instantly. In the future, traveling can also be less of a hassle, because they can get from place to place as fast as possible. Wow, that's so hard for the mind of mine to comprehend, but I'm so glad I have friends like you to help me with it. I guess this break isn't really a breakup. And we dance on